Druid's Heath tower block of despair as Dad says no child should live in filthy and dangerous flats. Families in the Druid's Heath 13 story block of flats claim the building should be condemned and young families given alternative places to live. Amid fears about fire risks and asbestos, water leaks, a lack of central heating and filthy lifts. We spoke to Dad Dave who lives here with his 7 year old daughter. What upsets me is the fact that when I walk through the door, is the dirt and the disgust, the lifts have always got sick, uh, human poo, um, dog poo, dog wee, uh, spit all over the, you know, spit all over the walls. Uh, my daughter won't go in the even lift because it keeps getting stuck. So when she doesn't want to go in the lift because there's too much sick in there, we have to walk up the stairs. Then when we walk up the stairs, there's drug paraphernalia uh, everywhere. There's dirty bags sometimes with tampons and dirty tampons. Um, it's just disgusting. The walls are disgusting. The whole place is shouldn't even be here. Should be knocked down, from my opinion. You talked to us earlier about yeah. how upsetting it is for you that your daughter's living in an environment that's just not very nice. Well, her mental health's terrible, but my daughter's still in the same situation. Her mental health is terrible. But when I say bad, I mean bad. Like, and as a father, you just try and do your best. I don't want to be stood here today on camera. I'm here for a reason because it's not just my daughter; it's everybody. What do you want the council to do? Take us seriously. Just listen to people. Stop thinking you know you're right. You know, I'll tell you what. Walk in my boots for a week. Come and live my life for a week. Let me live your life. And then when I ask you a question, you might take me serious. I've been like it for years, but you can only take so much. After a little bit, you start complaining. I've complained and complained and complained. I went down to the office, they ain't took it seriously. I've been to my MP, they still haven't took it seriously and now I'm with the papers. Okay, we've had the door changed over and they've left exposed wires and it's bad, it's a ticking time bomb. It's like a Grenfell, but on a smaller smaller scale. Uh, we're 150 foot in the air, so we can't jump out the window, which is too high, and we can't get out the door. We're stuck. 